All right, so I, I got it's now it's story time. Somebody sleeping there, sleeping. Okay, so um, I am a 36 year old male. Nick is a not 36 year old male. Yes, I am. Oh, you are 36. Yeah, I was I'm older than you. I was trying to get you younger. I was trying to. Okay, <laughs> so 10 ish years ago, I was living in South Carolina. And I had moved there. I was from Michigan. I didn't know anybody. I was trying to make friends with people in the town, and I just couldn't do it. I was feeling like I was in a foreign land, and I was very alone, okay? At the same time, I had developed a, uh, a gambling habit that uh, had really plagued me, and I couldn't shake it. And I was just in a very bad place. And in uh, October of 2006, my dad had a stroke. And he lived in Michigan, and when he had the stroke, uh, he, there was some recovery, and I wanted to move home to help out, partially because I wanted to help my dad and partially because I missed home. I was lonely. I was in a dark place. And when I moved home in the summer of 2007, I went to an old camp that I had gone to as a child. And uh, I thought maybe I'll run into some people that I knew back when I was in my teens. And I went and uh, lo and behold, a guy named Nick Diamond was there. Nick and I were in a camp uh, in a dorm together when we were very young. And uh, I saw him there, and he said, hey, a bunch of us are going to hang out in my semi-truck later tonight if you want to come hang out. And I said, hang out in a semi-truck. That sounds creepy. (laughs) But okay, let's hang out in the semi-truck. And I thought maybe I could connect with these guys. And so I get into the semi-truck. And if you've ever been inside of the semi-truck, it's huge. It's like a small apartment. He had bunk beds. He had a cooler. He had bunk beds and a cooler. And uh, there were 12 of us in the cab of his truck. And there were two guys, Nick and another guy that had a guitar, and they were playing old songs that we were singing along with. It was after hours. It was midnight. We were singing these songs. And at the same time when that was happening, there was a band that I loved called Nickel Creek, and they had a new song that had come out called This Side. And I loved it. I couldn't get enough of it. I was playing it over and over and over in my car, and I felt like I had this hidden gem that nobody had heard of. No one had heard this song before. And that night... I saw people I hadn't seen in 10 years, and we're sitting in the car, and we're playing music, and we stopped the song, and I said, hey, guys, there's this band that I love. you got to learn one of their songs. The the name of the band is Nickel Creek, and without missing a beat, they started this song, and it was 12-part harmony, and my mind was blown, and I fell in love with my friends again, and I reconnected from a very dark place. So this song has a uh, a special meaning to me, so we're going to sing it. You 
that's that song.